everybody. It is Sunday, lunchtime. May 13th, Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. Um, we are just chilling here at the house, waiting for the kids to come over for um, some meals and to help me out with some things I've been wanting to do around the house uh, that I need help with. They said, what do you want for Mother's Day? I said, you to come help me with these things. So, so they're going to do that. Yay. Good kids. Um, anyway, so that's it for right now. If I get any good footage of, or interesting, cute footage of them helping me or Lily, they're bringing the dog. I haven't seen the puppy in two weeks. So, uh, anyway, you know, I'll film it for you. So I'm going to go chill on the couch and have some more iced tea and I'll Hello, be back. Hello everybody. It is time is it? 143 on Sunday, Mother's Day. I'm making another Goodwill run while the kids help in the backyard with some other stuff. We have a bunch of old paint, house paint and old spray paint. <sighs> stuff like that we have to try to get rid of, which is always like a big giant pain. It should be easier to recycle. Less people would dump it in the landfill, which you're not supposed to do. It's not good for the environment. But less people would do that if there was an easier way to like drop it off somewhere. At least in California, it's kind of an issue. So I don't know. Hopefully the kids can help me figure out where to, what to do with that. If not today, then this week. So I'm going to go take the Goodwill stuff. And then they can help me load that other stuff in my car. So I found this little guy on the ground out here on the front porch. I think he's missing some, he seems to be missing some legs like he's been hurt. I'm going to put him in a safe place over here on this plant. It's a moth. He's pretty, he's real pretty. Oops, see he doesn't want to, oh there we go. There he is. He's up there. We'll leave him there. At least he won't get stepped on. How are you? We're in the car again. I hurt my arm yesterday. Ow, it's still sore. This is the one I had fixed a few years back. That's not good. Anyway, I've been all morning doing business, non-fun business stuff and making fo important phone calls and Unfortunately, feeling like I'm going nowhere fast, but I refuse to stop going. I'm gonna keep keep pushing, so we'll see what happens. Anyway, I can't really talk about it more than that, other than I'm frustrated. And um, now I have some Etsy orders that need to go out, so I'm gonna go up, head over to the postal place, and I have to pick up a few things at Staples. So. We're gonna go do that and then come back and just chill and have lunch today. And I'm hoping the rest of the afternoon is kind of quiet. That'd be a nice change. All right, I'll be back. Morning, everybody. It is 8.22, exactly. I know because I'm looking at the clock. Um, we're in my driveway, obviously. Or maybe not so obviously. Hair's wet again. You know, it's the norm, right? Uh, you guys wouldn't know what to do with me if I actually fixed my hair and put makeup on. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, anyway, it's been, you know, we have, we're, my husband and I are dealing with a lot of business stuff right now, and it doesn't make for Gina being a happy camper because I don't have that much time for creativity. I am squeezing in little bits here and there. Um, I did some paper cutting last night. Um, there is an artist whose name I can't remember right now who's here on YouTube. And if I can remember, I'll put her name like right here somewhere or link a video about her. Maybe I'll even do a card. Um, if I don't do the card, it's in the description. Um, anyway, all she, she cuts paper, like one intricate piece of paper every day. And if you watch her, you'll just be amazed. And while I am nowhere near on her level, I did do this one which we'll put here somewhere. Um, 
yesterday. I just, I needed a creative outlet. So I did film it. I did make some mistakes, which I also filmed. I'm not going to hide them. I do think I'm going to keep doing it. I, I probably need a smaller X-Acto knife. Uh, mine is a little bit on the large side for that kind of cutting. Um, but that being said, boy, was that a lot of fun. <sighs> Anyway, so now I'm going to go to the grocery store before I have more meetings and people coming by for estimates on work on the house. Again, yes, we're going through that again. It's a constant thing. My house was built in 1969, so it needs stuff done. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, um, so I'm going to go run to the grocery store because we're out of... Ugh, God forbid, coffee creamer. I need my coffee in the morning. So I'm going to go have to get coffee creamer and a couple of other things. And um, yeah, I'm going to go do that really quick. Maybe pop into Target really quick. And um, yeah, and then get my butt home. All right, I'll be back.
Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, March 16th. I should know this because I've already been filming stuff this morning. It is 1049 this morning, and I've already filmed all of my creative year for July. Although, between me flubbing up the topic and prompts and the dog barking, I'm probably going to have to do a bunch of voiceovers when I edit. So there's that fun thing. <laughs> I don't know. So I'm working now on my giant life for July, and then I'm going to do explorations of me for July, and then I'll be um, caught up through July. Um, I'm hoping to get everything filmed today and then edited tonight or tomorrow and then yeah then I can start working on August hopefully and um, yeah one month at a time um, but I got derailed a little bit this week I was hoping to get July and August done this week but I got derailed a little bit with business meetings and the gardeners are here now which is why the dog is barking and yeah <sighs> So anyway, I'm going to stop for a little bit. Of course, he's quiet now because I'm just doing the vlog and he's quiet. But when I'm filming a tutorial, like he's barking, like, you know, who knows? Anyway, I'm going to take a little break and have something to eat. And um, yeah, no appointments or anything today. Yay for a change. But I do have bookkeeping to do, which I still haven't done because I keep getting derailed by the other stuff. Anyway. All right. I'll be back. Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, May 17th. Yes, I thought about it for a minute, but I do know what the date is. Why? Because tomorrow's my wedding anniversary, May 18th. That's the only reason I know. Um, yeah, so it's 10 o'clock in the morning-ish. It's just after 10, actually, by a couple minutes. And... I need to go out and get an anniversary card for my husband because I haven't done that yet. But also I need to get something in San Jose that's called an extra garbage sticker. So in San Jose, if you have too much garbage for your can, you can put a 32 gallon trash bag out that's tied up shut tightly and shut with a, a sticker on it, which says you've paid extra money for them to pick up that garbage. Um, and my garbage people picked up today, but they didn't take anything in my recycle can because there was wood in there and they said the wood was not recyclable. Really? So I had to put all the wood in the garbage can, and which means that now the garbage can is already three quarters full and we have a week to go before the garbage gets picked up. So what do you want to bet I'm going to need the extra garbage sticker? The drawbacks of purging <laughs> when you have stuff that can't be given away and needs to just be tossed. This is one of them. <sighs> so anyway, I'm going to go run some errands, get some food. I need dinner for tomorrow. The kids are coming over. Yeah, all that stuff. So yeah, I'll be back. <sighs> you ever have that split second where you're out running errands, you reach inside your handbag to pay for something and you realize your phone's not in the bag and your bag's been open while you've been running errands and you're worried somebody reached in and stole your phone, but then you rationally think, but why wouldn't they take your wallet instead of your phone? You do panic a little bit and I realize I left it in the car. So at least I have my phone. I stopped into the Michaels that I used to work at. Fun fact, I used to be an art teacher at Michaels and uh, said hi to the girls, bought some little mini cactus plants. I should have bought them at the dollar store when they had them, but of course, by the time I decided I wanted them, they're out of stock. <laughs> of course they are. So anyway, it was right next door to the Michaels. I'm going to go home now because I have ice cream and, and frozen pizza in the back that are probably melting. So let's go.
guys. It is Friday afternoon, 2.24 to be exact. I know, only know that because I'm in the car and the clock is right there. Um, it is May 18th. I almost said May 19th. It's May 18th. I should know that date. Why? Because it's my wedding anniversary. There's little kids out in the court behind me. I'm going to try to do this without running them over. Talk about bad karma. Let's try not to run over small human beings. Oh, oh, oh. Dad's got to keep him on the sidewalk. Saturday celebrating our anniversary by going to the movies. We saw Black, Black Panther. Panther finally yep. and oh my gosh I loved it. So I don't know what the character's name is right now. I haven't had a chance to go googling but the female warrior, the head, the general girl. The lady, general. She was a general. She was a general right? She was a general. Yep. Can I be her when I grow up? Oh my god. She was beautiful. I, I would never look so gorgeous bald and she was powerful and I want to be her when I grow up. Anyway, I love the movie. Um, we'll have to get it. Yeah, and then I we went out for sushi and I, holy cow, they gave us a lot of food. I brought some home, uh, or I'm bringing some home, and then we um, went walking around the mall and yeah, so we're going to go home now. It's and, time for home. Yeah, veg in front of the TV. Yep. We hope you've all had a good week and you have a good day and um, you enjoy our little adventures and don't forget to do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And we'll see you next week. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.